This is a facility that was uh, as an outcome of the uh, Second Lebanon War in 2006 when uh, we were under attack with missile attacks and none of the hospital at the time uh, uh, was protected, none was fortified. So at the end of the war we have decided uh, that we must fulfill our mandate to give medical treatment in, under all scenarios and because of this we will build these three floors of underground parking lot. Each level is a five acres over 20,000 square meters that in case of emergency transforms to the biggest underground hospital of the in the world. We can give solution for 2,000 patients uh, but now uh, this uh, facility is uh, uh, made for the COVID-19 uh, patients uh, and we were asked by the Ministry of Health to give solution for 770 patients, 170 of them are ventilated. Once we open this facility or treat more COVID-19 patients, we will have to compromise first uh, on the quality of care and then compromise on the extent of treatment that we are able to give to uh, non-COVID uh, patients in the hospital. Uh, we have the facility, so we have the grounds, we have the equipment, but there is no doubt that the bottleneck or is the amount of staff that we have uh, to treat these patients.